Hello, friends and viewers and friends who are also these, and welcome to this week's more replicant stream. Um, this week we are going to be starting our playthrough for what you to see. Um, I've decided I'm going to go through the whole story again. Um, I think A, because I have to, um, but also just because it's be nice to experience it again, see how things are, are different if they are different. Um, Today's stream might be a bit shorter than usual, um, just because I'm already kind of low energy and I need to like re-energise myself because I'm going out tonight, um, unless I like pass out between now and then. Um, so today's stream might be shorter and it will definitely be kind of chill. Um, but I'm going to go this. Just loading. Mm -hmm. So over to the gameplay. Um, Except let's not because every day I must suffer. And that I can stop to the gameplay. And it's um, not going to work. Right. Good enough. Okay. Um. Right, I'd forgotten I'd made two different saves. We'll load into this one then. <sighs> I'm sleepy beat already. Oh, I also haven't checked if Streamlabs is alive yet. Does Mochi Bot live? Maybe. Did we honking see him? Yes, Mochi Bot does live. We'd love to see it. Whenever I interacted with Kaine, I was reminded about something from my past. Maybe my mind has been confusing her with my sister this whole time. Which is for the bridge hump. Anyway. Bear with me, um, having technical issues, as I so always do at the moment. Um, dive into Kanye's memories, yes. I'm going to skim read them. Um, I think it'll be the same as before, but nonetheless. Kanye's dreams, discrimination. Sound of rain filled the village. Why are my frames dropping so badly? Steep cliffs that surrounded the area magnified sound. There wasn't even the slightest drizzle to rattle like a thunderstorm. Thin wisps of smoke streamed from huts as the villagers huddled in their homes and waited out the rain. A single child, however, had braved the downpour and was now wandering slowly towards the wooden, hawk-shaped weather vane at the centre of town. The wanderer reached the vane, which had existed for as long as any could remember, and stared. The child's face was simultaneously delicate and fierce, a teacup that had survived a shipwreck. Those traits combined with pale white skin to give the face an almost sexless quality. The beak turns east as I go home. It stays west than I. The child blinked. Rain slowly draped the, down the young one's short hair and began its long descent to the ground. That slight breeze watched the plane slowly creep to the life. It's east. Really? Okay, so I think this is the same as before. Kind of guess. Kind of gets bullied by some kids.
Ugh, we'll find it. Well, that, that is the best cure, stupid. says Hong I'm like skim reading this and just in case any of it is uh, if it's new or different. So my name's Daily Life. Up next, chopping wood with grandma. Nico. Good Thank morning you. to the glittery god. Thank you very much for the resub. It is very much appreciated. How are you? I hope you're doing well. Gosh, 12 months. Ugh. How time flies. Um, I hope you're having a good day. I am um, still slightly covered in glitter as it's my bed and also the bathroom floor because uh, I had glitter on my hair yesterday. And I washed it out in the bathroom sink rather than have a shower at one in the morning because that's who I am as a person. So I'm definitely very glittery today. and my god hiccups. Ugh. I do like the apothecary here, being like good people. Pretend like that didn't happen. Um, oh, and Street Labs crashed as well. Great. <sighs> what second? The 
this dream labs to come back to life. This dream may be cut short either by my sleepiness or um, possibly technical issues if they keep happening. Right. Uh, what's great? Painting, realms. I got like a good night's sleep, it's just that I'm marginally hungover. <laughs> and um socializing. It's fine. <laughs> After this, I'm going to go grab a soda from the vending machine in the other building and um, chug that for uh, energy going out again tonight. So, we'll see how it goes. Left Kine. Sake. Sorry, I'm swearing at my phone now. Um, this segment first introduced us to the fact that root B slash C sucks ass. Maybe does. Chores and what she does a yawn. Kind of needs a very bug. Is wonderful. This is it, my TLDR. Suddenly, it's fire slash shade time. Just enjoying the music, to be honest. Oh, that's the cold. Going towards the monster. Being a shade with a pocket knife.
Let's see what's wrong. There's a really gross descriptor that I'm not going to read. And he is marginally possessed. Okay, can it, can it, can it? Light to kill and delight to live to blend into it. Spacing out and my controller vibrated there and it gave me a surprise. Beast approaches. Oh, I know. Time to do and fight. I thought I forgot that I was gonna try and do this one in normal. I wonder if I can change difficulty midway through like you can with Nia. Nice. This one I have equipped. It dies today. I saw it in the spider. It's not the blade, but the skill of the user. Strike it down. It's also because, um, <laughs> using a spear, which A is lighter, B feels much more comfortable to wield. Rip it to pieces. I just had a really abrupt thought, which is that I need to hold time super quickly, so bear with me. Shade away. My name is dying. <laughs> yep. Ah, uh, the joys of mechanical keyboard plus small desk. Um, make die. Extremely gross, bad mental imagery. And only black substance using from the day. It's 
time to get possessed by a shade. Tear up the throats and bathe in the blood. As it were. share time. Wrap them up, right assholes. I don't know. No thoughts, only murder. To use somewhere deep within so I can myself. Hannah has waited until she was sure the voice was gone and waved a new left arm around a few times. Feels perfectly normal, she thought. Feels like mine. Desperately, she began poking and prodding at the new limb, determined to find something wrong with it. She didn't want it to feel normal. That would be the creature inside her had already won. I'm not ashamed, I know. Repeating this mantra in her mind, she slowly began digging through the rubble of the house. <laughs> Pick up careful to ignore certain words stained the spot hick up in the corner. Finally, after what seemed like an eternity of heartbreaking work, she found what she was looking for. It was the wreath of lunar tears. Though it had been three hell and back, the garden's petals were as bright as ever. Penny started to place it in her head, then slowly lowered the wreath and stared at it. Sorry, Grandma. So sorry. But I don't deserve to wear this thing. Possessed, corrupted, freak. And this time I don't think there's any going. Holding the flowers to her heart, Kaine fell to the ground and saw. As night gradually lightened to dawn, the people of the area rose to their daily lives. She remained in that position, as if tears could somehow wash away the horror that now affected her world. Things like humming along, so, singing along to music. How long has it been? Five years. <sighs> Shit. That's a long time. Sure is. Any luck with Yona? We are still no closer to finding her. We need a way to locate the Shadow Lord. By the way, this is for you. Is that a lunar tear? Not grown in my garden, although I do intend to do that it's at some point. It's not as good as your grandmother's, but I tried. No, it's great. Thank you. Kaine waking from her long, petrified sleep. 
Emil's unflagging kindness. Our reunion was a happy one, and we let it wash over us like rain. That is, until Devola and Popola had to go and ruin it all. Are you kidding me? You can't be serious! Please, try to understand. People are tired and scared, and... I'm sorry. I'm sorry you have to bear the brunt of that. We should, like, expand our house a bit, then they could this stay with us. This is crap, and you know it! It's okay. We can sleep outside. Not again. Okay, much of what is alive, they just don't seem to be posting. Um, sorry, the reason I keep typing furiously is because I'm going out with some friends later um, and trying to work out like what the plan is, given that I am entirely limited by public transport or overpriced dry chairs. Um, so. No one's sleeping outside. You and Kaine saved this village. And now they want to run you out? That's why I keep People all typing to check it. <laughs> and really, I understand. I mean, look at me. As long as you're still with us, I can deal with it. So right, nice. Kaine? I'm used to sleeping outside. But... We'll see you later. Sorry about this. I should, you know, just like... Put like um, a sofa downstairs or something, and then maybe an extra room, um, and then like we could all stay at our place. What is the matter? Sorry, do do uh, Google. Here at eight. Okay, I think I'm gonna keep going streaming until seven, so another hour and a half. Um, just because that gives me plenty of time to like shower and eat and get ready um, before I hop on the bus. Um, sick. Cool, cool, cool. Kaine always sleeps outside. I never thought about that until just now. Never even occurred to me. Damn it. We should turn in. I didn't get much sleep that night. For the first time in my life, I hated Devola. For the first time in my life, I doubted Popola. But those feelings are pointless in the end. They said and did what they did for the sake of the village. I feel like I thought this and then never got around to saying it earlier. But, um... To protect it from the horror of the Shades. I'm really intrigued to see... So I know how Route B differed from Route A. <laughs> but I'm interested to see how Route C differs. Really, how can I blame Devola and Popola? I don't know if it, yeah, like... I'm just as bad. If it does... More than just, like... I stop to think about Kaine and Emil's situation myself. I don't, I don't know if it's the same up until the end. Um, but either way, because we don't have any side quests to do, we'll, like, blast through the story, so... As I understand it... Um... C and D are like, you make one choice, you get C, you make the other choice, you get D, and then E is like a completely new um, a new 
I know how to speak words. Thank goodness Mochibot is alive. I should apologize to Kaine and Emil, but what good would that even do? I got a fire going tonight. Wait, is that... Campfires are... I'm so happy to get to talk to you again, Kaine. Yeah, me too. I tried everything I could think of to save you, you know. I polished you with a special cloth. I poured warm water over you. I... Wait, you poured water on me? <laughs> yeah, but it didn't really do much except make you all shiny. <laughs> hey, Emil. Thanks for saving me. I guess you noticed how I look different now. I'm sorry, Emil. I'm sorry for all of it. Well, I mean, this new form isn't all bad, you know? Okay. There we go. Right. At least I can look at you when we talk, right? Hey, so why don't you tell me something about yourself? I'm not very interesting. Sorry. Come Absolute on. Lie. I just want to know you better. Please? Fine. This all happened when I was a kid. Before the whole shade possession thing. My body is... different. And when the villagers found out about it, they started treating me like a freak. But one person, my grandmother, accepted me just as I was. No matter how bad things got, she gave me the strength to keep going. She's really special to you, huh? Yeah. Oh, hey! That gives me an idea. Since we cured your petrification, we should start looking for a way to cure your possession and my body. I know we can do it if we all work together. Heck, it'll probably be super easy. Deep breaths. Let me guess. More warm water? Okay. Can we just forget I told you about that? <laughs> okay, so we've got... Tagged in a <laughs> chat I haven't looked at in about probably two years. Actually, when was the last message? The last message was in May, but I must have skimmed red because. <laughs> Old chats. I said about how loud my mom. I wonder if my dad was like that. Huh. Sleep well? Sure. And yet your red eyes tell a different tale. Don't be so hard on yourself, lad. I need to go see Devola and Popola. Very well. So we're not going to diary except for the part where we are, but just for the good, kind of all seemed wow. Um, I'm probably gonna fuck about in diary a bit. Um, the Speaking of which, I want to have a little book. See if there's anything I can. Upgrade the axe of beheading. So 
Eat each other. Let's just... Okay. This is wonderful because my goal is to upgrade um, all of the weapons to level four this playthrough, so. Hey. Oh, uh, hi. I kind of thought you'd never talk to us again. I understand you're doing this for the village, and that you don't have a choice. Pretty much, yeah. But look, why don't you go talk to Popola? I think she wanted to discuss the Shadow Lord with you. I'm headed there next. Oh, and Devola? Yeah? Sorry about yesterday. I shouldn't have lost my temper like that. You don't need to apologize. Anyone would be upset when their friends are hurting. Let Emil and Kaine know that we're sorry, all right? All right. Being awkward and quiet because I'm thinking about travel logistics. You know how it be. Apologize for yes. Stop. You didn't do anything wrong. Yeah, but neither did you. You're just trying to protect the villagers. And I jumped down your throat for it. It's very kind of you to say so. Regardless, please don't let it trouble you. Ahem. <sighs> I believe there was something you wished to discuss with us. Oh, right. Yes, about that. You know about the Lost Shrine, right? The temple where I was first discovered. That's it. Well, it seems that the Shadow Lord's lair is connected to it somehow. Oh, ho. Oh. It was right under our pages the whole time. But the bridge that leads there is unusable. So, take a boat. A boat? Yes. The canal's finally been repaired. It took a lot longer than expected. I also asked them to provide a boat at the path to the Lost Shrine's back entrance. The ferryman will let you use it free of charge. That should make it easier for you to move from town to town. Thanks, Popola. I feel like you've done so much for me. I'm really grateful. I can't, um... <sighs> Alright. I'll see you around. And for the love of everything, be careful. And for... Okay, she just says that, right. I am sorry for multitasking while trying to stream. It is very bad manners. Um, but there we go. Okay. path above the entrance to the shopping district should lead to the boat landing. Multitasking, I am. How excellent to know the canal is finished. 
Hopefully this puts our days of running all over behind us. The faster we can move, the faster we can save Yona. Let's use it as often as we need. I am going to the Northern Plains, because... Oh, actually, I don't know if I can visit Gideon yet. Well, we'll go see if we can. If not, then I will just suffer instead. That's fine, I can do that too. Yeah, that reminds me, I wanted to check a thing. I guess I can't change the difficulty on fly. Oh well. Stop being books. Start being um it's a drawing. Genuinely have no idea if this um So we didn't have to worry about it. But we'll go to the junk heap first. Yeah. It's that guy, right. He's your second guy. Um, having done the diary last time around, that guy's still... Get to fuck about my dad. Don't give me a recovery potion. I need... Keep jewelry. Hey, look who it is. Remember me? That red bag. I, my pages. You're the slovenly half of that couple who refused to stop arguing. Hey, it's been a while. Sure has. I've been in charge of this canal since we last talked. Apparently I did a pretty good job with it because they decided to make me the permanent ferryman. Oh yeah, huh? 
thanks. Still, it's not all puppies and unicorns. The old ball and chain is always harping on me now about how much I work. Anyway, if you got a place to be, just let me know and I'll take you there. Let the ferry me cross this stretch of water. What you put a chick going with it? it makes little chirps and follows me around, and it's just the cutest thing ever. But back in any Lost shrines up ahead, just past this cave. As well as the shadow of its castle. Let us make haste. Let us indeed. What do you want? Go away, dirty defective swine. Not like you. Different. What me has always wondered. Like, it does not make sense for Devil and Popular to have shades, given that they are robots and not humans. But at the same time, part of me has always wondered if maybe they are at least somehow like related to Devil and Popular, even if they're not like their shades, just the them being twins and like one of them dying and leaving the other one be only for a bit, but uh, you know how it be. Also, something I find really interesting is that I was looking this up, and so, um, so Devil and Popola were supposed to, like, carry out the plan to rejoin humans in their shades, right? And then they failed because we beat them, um, and as a result of that, they were sort of universally reviled and became, like, the hated figures that we see in Automata, where they, like, redeemed themselves by helping us, um, win in the end, I guess. Um, such as there is any sort of winning in that game. Um, anyway, I just thought that was kind of neat. You again? Stop bothering me. Grandma Vice has been taken away. Hansel is dead. There's no reason for me to exist anymore. My life is over. Just leave me alone. Sunshine, we finally get to bathe in blood. No one around this way. Don't talk to me. <laughs> I want to kill so bad I can barely stand it. Okay, I apologize. Um, apparently, we're being attacked by a thing, but I did not notice because, um. I'm guessing a boat outside just did an extremely big honk. Also, my controller is having some problems. Okay. Thanks for, like, doing the hard work for me. Apologize. I got absolutely distracted by the boat honking, as is so often the case when it comes to me. I love this bear. 
really is my favorite. Doing her forty foot vertically. Oh, while we're here, I want to See if there's anything. That's where it is. Okay. I just have to hope that they stop dropping herbs. Start actually dropping the items that I need from them. What it is is that I'm an idiot and was pressing the wrong button. This is all too easy. I need to remember before I do anything else to take some cash out as well. That may seem completely apropos of nothing, and it kind of is, but at the same time... Two of them. I have got two more. Packs into the game to tell it to stop giving me herbs. Sorry, I'm just um, thinking. I 
Ja, und jetzt kommt der. Anytime I pause an alt tab, it's because um, looking at um, better. God, I haven't gone out in like I'm gone out like dancing in so long. Turn back. Turn back. What's with these guys? Certainly not your garden variety of shades. Their bodies aren't fully functional. Say, I've heard of this. A cursed area where incomplete shades gather. Apparently the place that we're going tonight can sometimes have a quite a long wait, like quite a long queue to get in. And so I'm trying to remember when I used to go to heaven more regularly um, as an undergrad, how long the queues for that were. Because if, pre, if I pre-gamed at, at movie night when I was an undergrad, usually the queues would be relatively short because we'd get there pretty early because we would just walk down the road from uni. So. At least I can guarantee that tomorrow I'll probably be less hungover than tired, which is something. I'm sure this is what you all tune in to stream for, is me chuntering about where I'm going out later tonight. and make three seconds. Doesn't drop me. I turn. Like a shirt. I can't remember there being anything relevant in there, so it's just not.
I treated you all poorly. I mocked you, betrayed you, all because you went gestalt before the change was complete. But after all this, I think I can understand you. I think I can speak as equal. This makes me very happy. I hope we can spend the rest of our life. What's that? I'm going to sleep outside with you. Why? I can't accept that you aren't allowed in the village. It's stupid. So you're staging a protest? Have fun! Don't waste your time. But it just feels wrong. Well, that's really nice of you, but you still don't have to stay out here with us. Emil. You've got a super important mission. You can't sleep out in the rain. What if you catch a cold? What Besides, I like camping with Kaine. Sometimes we sit around the fire and tell stories, or roast... Emil, that's enough. I got a fucking image to maintain. way of um, forcing yourself to stay up is to so I know for a fact there is nothing around here so we seem to be surrounded by a mob of helpless puppies just kick them aside don't do that how rude Loves. No, one school book. Great. to the light. Pathetic to the end, I see. Aim for that statue. It's the leader. I'm no, not their leader. It is I who am I there. It is they who say to me. Stop fighting my friends. Ends badly. Have you felled the beast? Those are my friends. Embrace the slaughter. 
All we know is the thrill of battle. Ain't that right, Kaine? Stiff legs. Oh, rain drops. Brilliant. We love to see it. Managed to avoid the blood somehow. They look incredibly cool. I'm like, oh shit, yeah. Kanye, are you all right? Kanye. <gasps> I fear there is little we can do for her. No! Kaine! What is happening? <laughs> it's all over for you, sunshine. Kaine! Kaine! Like, it's terrifying but cool at the same time, you know? It's Kaine's shade! With no other choice, we must strike it down! Kaine! Come back! Okay. Oh dear. Kaine! 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 First, and then comes back to life. I... I couldn't hold it back. No, Harvey. I can't be with... We're always going to be together, Kaine. If you transform again, we'll just stop it again. As many times as it takes. I don't care how tough it is. We're gonna get you back. I like sleeping outside because I'm with you, Kaine. I'm able to ignore my appearance and keep going because of you. I'm weak and I'm sad and I'm lonely. But you make me strong. You're my friend and I need you. So don't you dare leave me! <laughs> all right, all right. Stop crying. I like that when Emil does that speech there, you can't actually, like, advance the text. He advances it for you. And thanks. It's time for something to hunk. Not sure if bridge or plane or boat or car or what, but there we go. And mysterious is this? Mm -hmm. It's me. It's got some kind of writing on it, but I don't know what it says. How remarkably useless of you. Well, let's go ask Popola. Remarkably useless. It's a cipher of some kind. Can you determine its meaning? I think this is the key to unlocking the Shadow Lord's castle. Here, take a look at this. 
I wrote down all the words I can understand. This fragment is called the Stone Guardian. Given that you found it in the Lost Shrine, the words must mean something. There are spaces here for four other fragments as well. Sacrifice, the Law of Robotics, the Memory Tree, Loyal Cerberus. The Law of Robotics probably refers to the Junk Heap, and the Memory Tree might be the Forest of Myth. But as for Sacrifice and Loyal Cerberus, I don't have a clue. Not a problem. Hmm? If we want to fill in the words, we just run around the world killing every big monster we find. I mean, I guess. Oh, splendid. By all means, let us undertake a murderous rampage. They're just shades. Besides, it's a dangerous task. Then we just get the dialogue there. Yeah, well, Yona's in even more danger. But how can you even be sure that she? Because she is, right? Uh. Hmm. The junk heap and the forest of myth. Yeah, I'm on my way. Please be careful. Oh, and listen about Kaine and Emil. Villagers know how much they've sacrificed, and they're thankful. It's just... they're scared, you know? People can't change overnight. I'll hurry them along the best I can. But can you please give them a little more time? Okay, sorry. I'll try. Marching social. I think a little less will be okay, right? I mean, not on purpose, but managing like IRL social life. That's what I was getting at. We might be able to find sinking. a key fragment in the junk heap. Perhaps we can find a clue at Two Brothers Weaponry. Let's do that. But... Leaving. This way. Yeah, have the energy to farm the area for. Looks like he left the village. Yeah. You think he'll be able to find all the fragments? If he doesn't, these past five years will have all been for nothing. Now that we know the location of the original Gestalt, the Shadow Lord, we have to stop his rampage. I can't believe the Shadow Lord ran off and holed up like that. I worry the Shades who guard the key fragments will pose too much of a threat. Maybe so, but we're pretty much out of options at this point. <sighs> you having second thoughts, sis? No. The plan is all that matters. We must see the plan to completion. He is simply a tool to that end. Gosh. There we go, eh?
something about the shades that got the fragments that we're looking for is that they're all incredibly depressing. I've never seen the last one of them. Also, I have what's changed my mind. What I'm going to do is. I don't want to do a full factory run when I may have to be leaving earlier than planned. So, what I'm going to do instead is go chat to Gideon, get that like open, and then next week we can hop straight in at the factory. I think this will be the easiest way to do it. Uh, does mean today is super short stream, but there was a very good chance I wasn't going to stream today anyway, and then like plans changed. So, Damn! where'd they go? Get them! Don't let them escape! I'm gonna die now. I'll try. Let's see something over there! You're almost growing up now, Stay strong. You must run now. You understand? Run as fast as you can. Okay, I'll challenge you. Stay for Stay for Promise me that you will remember all of them. Mum? Mum, wait. Let's go together. Mum. Who's there? Who are you? I'm Colleen. What's your name? Military Defense Robot, P-33. You are an intruder. You must be eliminated. Error. There is something leaking from your eyes. Find you, big dumb robot. I miss my mom. What is crying? Who is mom? It doesn't matter. I can't see her ever again because she's dead. My creator is also dead. He perished hundreds of years ago. Hundreds of years ago? Really? 874 years, 10 months, 14 days, 4 hours, and 43 minutes. 44 minutes. I am incapable of being lonely, or missing others, or crying. I'm crying because I don't want to die. You will die. If the humans catch me, they're gonna kill me. Why will they kill you? I will not permit the humans to kill Khalil. Huh? Military defense robot P-33 will protect you. You're gonna help me? P-33 is charged with defending others. P-33 will defend Khalil. Hooray. Thanks, robot. I think since we're friends now, I'm gonna call you BP. Title of next stream. That just rampage begins. Man, there's got to be tons of machinery here. Yeah, but I don't know how much we can actually use. 
Oh, wow. Check this out. It looks brand new. Hey, be careful, all right? This place is dangerous. Uh, I'll be fine. Oh, no. Huh? Look out! Huh? Jacob? Oh, God. This can't be happening. Jacob! Jacob! No! Yeah, we love to see some classics transference. Can't handle the fact that I was responsible, so I'm going to blame that robot. Oh, that was scary. The noise of the intruders caused the structure to fail. They should have proceeded with more caution. One intruder has perished. Oh, that's terrible. I don't think they were chasing me. They seem nice. Oh, geez. Don't know why. How could this happen to me? Made my mistakes, etc. The junkie. Perhaps we should speak to the brothers. They might know something about this. Let's do that, and let's also upgrade some weapons. Oh, hey there. It's been a while. You're the little one, aren't you? You've grown up. How fares your brother? My brother's been dead for four years. Oh, I see. Please forgive the question. It's okay. I need to ask you something. What is it? You heard any rumors about shades around here? Not the little ones. I'm looking for one that's unusually big and powerful. No, I haven't heard about anything like that. But I haven't really been listening. All I want is to destroy robots. Just rip them up. Uh, okay. Never mind then. See you later. Wait! Yes. I recently got my hands on a weapon. A very powerful weapon. I thought you might get some use out of it. Don't we already have this weapon? Shh. These things happen the second time around. Do you love that dialogue? This sword has seen better. Yeah, it's it pretty is. beat up. I mean, there's potential, but it's fairly powerless right now. Can you repair it? I can repair anything with the proper materials. If you'll fix it, I'll get the parts. <laughs> I'm so glad I decided not to throw this out. I'm gonna need some memory alloy. Only the real big enemies on the second basement level have them, so watch yourself. Also, here's the passcode to get down there. Use it on the elevator. You got it. You passcode. I'm gonna need only the real. You got. It. By the. What can I help you?
Uh, let's do one except the heading because I'm not actually sure if I can um, upgrade it to the. Not. Oh. Um, is there anything which easily upgrade? Doubt it, but it's always worth it. To Okay. Come. Well, I am going to end things off here. Um, I know it's extremely early, but um, sometimes that's just how it be in this bit of a world. Um, I am going to say thank you very much for watching. It is very much appreciated, and I do hope that you enjoyed. It was used for the uh, very short stream, but it's because I have IRL stuff going on. Um, I will be streaming Destiny 2 tomorrow, uh, where we will be continuing to try and catch up on challenges. Then on, um, I just realized my desktop audio didn't mute, whoops. Um, Tuesday it'll be Final Fantasy XIV, where I'm actually, hopefully this time for real, going to finish off the Relic Quest. Thursday you will be Higurashi when they cry Miyotsukushi Mote, where we are going to hopefully uh, be able to save Satoka. And then um, next Saturday will be more near Replicant, where we are actually for real going to be continuing with Rootsy proper. So thank you very much for coming along. Do have a wonderful evening and be excellent to each other and I shall see you guys tomorrow.